One of the things I've discovered is probably the reason why people don't really understand what I'm trying to say isn't because of my views, since views are, and opinions are mostly related to your beliefs and values, and people know that very well. They know the names of my philosophy. What they don't know is my school of thought which sucks because my methodology is really screwed up. I don't know them myself. I look at things in a very heterodox means of research. Because of this unorthodox research methodology, I can't do that thing where uh, most people would say, Oh, well, I've kind of study the economic viewpoints of Austrianism but I have the political viewpoints of Randian objectivism and the Austrian perspectives a little bit Rothbardian I can't do that stuff because everything's so unorthodox my school of thought can really be something that most libertarians would be annoyed with because it's all over the place. I remember this situation happening with Brain Police 2 and this, I think this weird um, girl. I know her name, her username, but I'm not going to say it because I don't want to call out people like I normally do all the time even though I despise this bitch this cantankerous deluded whore this butch ass lesbian slut regardless <laughs> that was kinda mean and she unsubscribed to him simply because she couldn't understand his views simply because she didn't know the school thought that's what I can benefit from the series that I'm looking up going through every chapter of all the mainstream writers um, I'm starting off with Murray Rothbard getting away the easy thing and now I'm gonna do the seven people I've listed 47 people okay, I'm gonna look at and review the main writings main political writings of Ron Paul Ayn Rand Milton Friedman Stefan Molyneux John Locke, Adam Smith, and Noam Chomsky. I think I could benefit a lot from that. Ugh. Glad I'm wearing a decent shirt nowadays, so I don't have to do that annoying thing. However, when I show one color, it uploads instantly. This, I have to wait for it to finish processing, and that can be very, 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 very annoying. Uh, I like the beard though. The mustache and beard combo is kind of my favorite. I look too childish when it's completely shaved. This looks cool. Like if I wanted um my way, I'd have this shaved. Now I have this cut really short and this with a beard or no beard and then this remain long. Because if it's both ways then it either looks really dirty or really awkward. And I kind of like my beard thing so I'm probably going to just have this really short and keep the beard. That's what I want. Probably gonna get a haircut um, Wednesday. Why am I talking about this? I should be talking about how people are having a hard time because they don't know my school of thought. I don't give a shit. Fuck them. <laughs>